Historically, network operators have relied on ports and protocols to monitor and manage network traffic and applications. But today, just the sheer volume of applications running across the network, things like social media, cloud-based business applications, streaming media, require operators and network managers to have a much higher application level view into what's going on. And that's where deep packet inspection and network intelligence comes into play. So now you're looking at adding network intelligence into your solution. You've got two options. You can build the technology from the ground up, investing a significant amount of time, resources, and money into doing so, or you can look to partner with Procera. We are the network intelligence experts. And our Navel-based solution will allow you to quickly integrate deep packet inspection and network intelligence into your platform, dramatically reducing the time and risk of bringing that solution to market. Navel is really a software library which our uh, OEM partners and uh, customers can actually make use of. They can embed this into their uh, applications. Uh, and what it really is, is a packet parser uh, and a packet and a flow analyzer. And it is able to identify what are the different applications on these flows. And is also able to then parse out the applications and actually extract the metadata elements and make these elements available to the application or whatever is the end product which our partners are trying to build. A traditional DPI has really been about trying to run a regular expression type of an engine on a particular flow, trying to find some sort of uh, patterns in that flow and then say, hey, look, I found a particular application or I found a particular protocol. That approach actually unfortunately doesn't work anymore. The scalability in Navel actually comes from the way we go ahead and try and do this classification. We don't just sort of have a complete list of all the things we want to start searching for and we start searching for that blindly on the first packet coming in itself. There is a whole uh, structure to the way we try and recognize these different applications. So think about it. Uh, 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 flow comes in, we uh, basically go ahead and parse that flow and we say, okay, look, I found the Ethernet header. After the Ethernet header, I know that, okay, I'm going to find an uh, IP header. If I find the IP header. After IP, I know that the, that the possibilities which exist are for TCP and UDP. On top of TCP, I know that, okay, the possibilities are for all the different protocols on TCP. So whenever we are trying to search for a particular application, we know where we are trying to search for it, on which particular um, application layer do those applications kind of exist. So whenever we add new classification uh, signatures or classification techniques, we are adding those specific to the type of protocol on which they are operating. And this sort of allows us to scale uh, and be able to still maintain our performance even when new signatures and new applications are being constantly added. What we're looking at here is a demonstration showcasing a full 90 gigabits per second of deep packet inspection and classification on an off-the-shelf Intel x86 server. We've got five Intel baseline cards, each with two 10 gigabit per second ports feeding traffic into this system. At the top, we can see the network throughput broken up by application as it streams across updating every second. Down in the bottom left, we can see each application and the associated number of flows, packets, and bytes, each updating per second as well. What's most interesting to note on this visualization is down in the bottom right, looking at the CPU utilization, we're doing this full 90 gigabits per second of classification, utilizing just 31% of the overall processor power. So if you think about all the various different use cases for something like Naval, you can pretty much use it everywhere. You can use it in uh, products which you are focusing on for the enterprise market, for the service provider market. In all of these products, you really need to be able to identify what the applications are. And after you've identified what those applications is, then you want to apply the various different uh, cost policies. If you're doing a PCEF type of sort of a function for a service provider uh, type of deployment, or if you are really trying to build a firewall or you're trying to build a next generation IPS, where you want to be able to extract the metadata, all the different pieces of information, be able to create different type of uh, threat models, and then be able to uh, take whatever is the appropriate actions for that type of traffic. Partnering with Procera Networks not only gets you access to our network intelligence technology, it gets you access to our exemplary customer support and maintenance going forward. And 
Navel as a full software based solution is going to get you ready with network intelligence today, but also help ensure that you're prepared as you move into network function virtualization and software defined networking tomorrow.